Over the past year, cryptocurrency-backed lending has grown very popular with organizations like Salt Lending and Unchained Capital trying to capture a piece of this emerging industry. Projects like Salt Lending have issued millions worth of crypto-backed loans so far and the teams behind these digital currency operations believe crypto-to-cash lending is going to be a pretty big deal in the future. Furthermore, this week a company called Nexo also plans to offer a digital currency for cash lending platform and raised $50 MNUSD in capital from venture capitalists like the TechCrunch founder Michael Arrington. Over the past year, cryptocurrency-backed lending has grown very popular with organizations like Salt Lending and Unchained Capital trying to capture a piece of this emerging industry. Projects like Salt Lending have issued millions worth of crypto-backed loans so far and the teams behind these digital currency operations believe crypto-to-cash lending is going to be a pretty big deal in the future. Furthermore, this week a company called Nexo also plans to offer a digital currency for cash lending platform and raised $50 MNUSD in capital from venture capitalists like the TechCrunch founder Michael Arrington. Two lending projects trying to make a mark in the crypto lending industry Unchained Capital Crypto to Cash Lending is growing quite popular these days Unchained Capital is a firm that offers cash loans to businesses and individuals who provide Bitcoin Core BTC, as collateral. The company believes cryptocurrency holders need a method to borrow against their digital assets without selling them. Unchained Capital's interest rates are between 12.5 to 14% APR and funds are wired to a bank account of the customer's choosing. Customers make monthly payments on the loan and once the credit is paid in full collateral will be reimbursed. Moreover, Individuals can borrow up to $1 MN without a credit check and the ratio of loan appropriation is 50%. If the value of the collateral drops by 25% Unchained Capital will request more capital. If the digital asset dips below the 45% region the company can repossess the capital to recover any lost principal and interest. Unchained Capital loans USD to American residents and businesses with options to renew a loan when it comes to term. Both individuals and businesses may want to utilize a loan for tax savings as borrowing removes the need to pay capital gains. Then there is another program called SAL Lending. A blockchain-backed loan program built on top of the Ethereum network. SALT tokens are created from the ERC-20 branch. The SALT lending platform is more peer-to-peer -peer than Unchained Capital as it lends funds from a large group of SALT lenders. The project has gained a lot of attention and has lent over $40 MNUSD worth of digital currency loans since the project's inception. Further, the SALT lending platform has accrued over 65,000 members in less than a year. Just like Unchained Capital once a loan is paid back on the SALT lending platform then a borrower can obtain their cryptocurrency again. According to SALT under Regulation D of 17 CFR Section 230.501 at SEQ. All lenders are accredited investors who have passed a lending suitability test. There are various ways a lender will participate with the SALT lending system and loans are processed using traditional financial markets. SALT users can borrow funds between $10,000 and $1,000,000 and no credit check is required. 
A new peer-to-peer -peer lending economy emerges crypto-to-cash lending has been a trending business model in this industry for well over a year and there are other platforms trying similar ventures like CoinLoan, Othera, Ethland, and Everix. The popularity of this type of business is growing due to the many benefits loans like these offer such as lending without credit checks and the ability to obtain fiat based off crypto reserves without paying capital gains. It's likely there will be a lot more startups attempting to enter this market as the crypto-to-cash lending economy is growing vibrant. What do you think about cryptocurrency lending projects? Let us know your thoughts on this subject in the comments below. Thank you for listen to my channel. Please is subscribe for get hot news in the world.